Hi guys, this is Mandy from the Mandy K Way, and today I am going to be doing another Christmas video and another little red truck video. If you saw my last video about my decoration of my red truck, you know that this is one of my new obsessions for this Christmas season. I have to thank my mom for this little red truck as well. It showed up in a little goodie Christmas box of decorations for me a few weeks ago and I just fell in love with it and I wanted to share it with you guys. And if you're interested in this little red truck set that I am going to show you, I will have a link down below in the description for you guys to go check it out. So let me go ahead and show you guys what I'm so excited about. That's right, it is my little red truck and Christmas tree salt and pepper shakers. I think they are absolutely adorable. So I'm not sure why it never crossed my mind that there would be a little red truck and a Christmas tree salt and pepper shaker. They have salt and pepper, sh salt and pepper shakers for everything else. I just didn't think about it. So I was so excited when I opened the box and saw the shakers. It just, as the final cute touch to my kitchen. That's where I decorated my trucks with this Christmas. So in just a minute, I'm going to show you an up close view of the salt and pepper shaker. But first I wanted to show you where the holes are located on each shaker. Um, the Christmas tree is going to be your salt shaker. Um, it has the two holes up here on the top of the tree and then on the bottom is where you would take your little stopper out and fill it up with salt and the truck is going to be your pepper because it has the three holes and it's right on top here of the truck and then again on the bottom is where you take your little stopper out and fill it up with pepper the only thing i'm worried about with these salt and pepper shakers are the holes are huge. So in all honesty, I think these are just going to stay on my counter as a decoration. Um, Cause I am just really worried that I will mess something up that I'm cooking because I pour too much salt or pepper into it. But I think they are so cute. I wanted to do a video on them. And there's one more thing I wanted to show you guys. Um, now I don't know if it's with all of them or just mine but there is only one way that the tree fits in properly. And you can tell because it fits straight in flat. Any other direction, it kind of angles, which I, is this is the way I had it at first because I didn't realize that it was supposed to be straight up and down. So all other ways, it just like angles. So there is only that one way that it sits perfectly straight and the bottom fits right into the bed of the truck very well. So let me go ahead and show you a close up of these cute little salt and pepper shakers. The first view that I'm going to show you guys is the side view. And here you can see a nice straight on view of the Christmas tree with the little red ornaments and the yellow star. And on the truck, you can see, I think on this side that it's supposed to be um, holly. I think would be my best guess of what's painted on the door. And I love how it's not necessarily painted really neatly. I love how it looks hand painted. All right, let's move on to the front view. I just love this little front view because it looks kind of looks like he's smiling at you with his the two little windows as the eyes. I just love this view. And let's flip it over to the other side view. Um, it basically is the same view as the first side that I showed you. And let's go ahead and move it over to the back side. It seems like the front and back are my favorite. I love the little ho 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 on the tailgate of this truck. And now I'm going to show you a close up of the Christmas tree. I like how they did a variegated color scheme on it, how it has the light and the dark green. Love the little additions of the red Christmas balls and the yellow star on top. And here is a view of just the truck without the tree in it. I think it's also really cute just by itself. So that was a close up view of the salt and pepper shakers. Now these are made of ceramic, so they are glass and you are going to want to be careful with them. You're going to keep them somewhere where you're not going to knock them off the counter or have anybody 
drop them. If you do hit them or clank them, they are going to probably chip. And uh, I would think being ceramic that they would break fairly easy. So you're definitely want, going to want to be careful with these. So that's going to wrap up my video about my little red truck and Christmas tree salt and pepper shakers. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you liked this video, give it a thumbs up and please consider subscribing to the Mandy K way. Again, I will have a link in the description below if you're interested in these salt and pepper shakers. And I'll also have a link below if you want to go check out some other little red truck decorations. So I hope you've enjoyed it and I will see you next time. Bye!